Put your heart out in my cup, yeah, but I let that cup spill. We can pick it up still. Met you in the club, yeah, so you know what's up. You know who I was, yeah. Wake up, the birds sing me a song. Maybe, maybe we could dream there again. It's too late to try to save me, my love.
All right, all right. Hello? Mic check, one, two. All right. Everything looks good. Welcome, guys. Welcome to Hell Let Loose Seasonal Spring 2024. This week is week two. Uh, my name is City. And we have Circle versus Alpha today. As everybody starts to load in, uh, I will introduce you guys to my co-cast. Uh, first off, a guy that I've casted plenty of times with before. He he has his own cast. Uh, if you guys ever want to check out some of his uh, streams and stuff, you could follow him on YouTube and Twitch as like Wix Wix streams. Wix, how you doing? I'm good. How are you? Thanks for having me. Well, great, man. It's uh, it's it's early morning for us as uh, EU versus uh, China. It's the the times could be uh, pretty either super early or late for us. So good to have you here. Um, I also have another guest. Uh, it is Yamamoto. Yamamoto, how you doing? Hi, I'm good. You good? Nice to it's... see you. Thank uh, you for having me. Yeah. Um, uh, I know it was like pretty short notice, and you probably got like a random message from like from like from me. Uh, yeah. Not very uh, expecting, like, oh, this this guy wants me to cast with him, sure. Um, but I'm enjoyable. Yeah. Um, so, Yamamoto, um, you know, being one of last year's fearless leaders of uh, FOC. Uh, a great Hell Let Loose player now playing for uh, WTH. Um, how's everything, man? Like, how is how is Hell Let Loose? How is your new team? Um, and what are some of your thoughts of what you expect from this game with uh, Circle well, and Alpha? Well, as always, Hell Let Loose is always a good game play mm -hmm. like a 50 50 you have to cooperate with your friends your teammates and uh, mm -hmm. take the point it's quite quite interesting and having fun and talking about the alpha vstc i'm saying the both team are good teams right to me so i'm expecting I'm expecting the both team doing very good performance today. Yeah, so but I'm Chinese, so a little bit greedy, so I must I think I support for Alpha this time. Yeah. How about you, Wix? Um SME, very familiar map. We just played this against SLK yes maybe a couple hours ago actually. Um SME, Circle, Alpha, what do you think? Uh What's your I mean, SME is a really balanced map, so it's it's kind of a fun map to, to see teams on because you know that really the side is not going to necessarily have a huge, huge impact on it. Um, when it comes to the teams, I mean, I'm excited to see uh, how these two teams match up against each other um, because, you know, you and me play on, a, on another Group A team, um, so we already played Circle on uh, SME, and we're going to play Alpha... Uh, next week on the map to be determined. So I'm curious to see how they match up. Uh, my instincts tell me that uh, the circle. I'm, I'm going to take the opposite side of Yamamoto just to uh, just to add to the intrigue of the cast, I guess. And, and I'll say that I think that uh, the circle is going to take it here. Uh, but you know, Alpha is a very good team, and I would not be surprised in the least if they were able to uh, to put up a good showing and, and take the victory. Oh yeah, uh, what. The circle, I mean, just from our experience, like playing them last week, as uh, they did play Axis last week, um, and then uh, us being familiar with playing against Alpha from either GXV or the Helios One, I think this should be a pretty good game. But um, I know in the pregame show, uh, Yamamoto, I was asking you about like Alpha and. Um, like this year, they don't, they don't seem as, uh, at least from my opinion, they don't seem as strong as last year. And you were saying that some people, some squads left, that and now, 
Um, yeah, some squads left and some uh, some infantry is going. People is floating to teams to teams. Yeah, but it's it's okay. They still have like the same leadership, right? Like the same commander and like tank squads and stuff. Do you know? Same tank squad. Tank, same tank squad right now, but commander just changed to another guy called uh, Shi Jichuan. Mm. He is also a very uh, old old alpha member. Mm. So yeah, I'm I have quite confident of his commanding skill. Tell me. Hope he is doing his best today. Oh, so we have a map change, guys. Um today thank you guys for tuning in we are on a 30 minute delay uh you're watching hello loose seasonal group a uh 2024 this is circle versus alpha um as uh alpha is allies and circle is axis um i think this this is probably a question for like both of you guys but uh this is pretty much like a must win right with um both of them losing their their matches last week, I think, to make it out the group stage. Yeah. I know I know Group A has five games that they play. Well, four four teams will make it out. The the top two in the group go to the upper bracket, um, and the 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 third and fourth will go to the lower bracket for the playoffs. Right. So I think both of them, I mean, you can lose today and still obviously make it out in the one of the lower bracket seeds, but if they want to be playing for one of the upper bracket seeds, then I agree it's a must win because I don't think the, the number two team or the number one team are going to have more than one loss. All right. So the format being a little bit different this year, uh, we have a lot less teams this year as well. But we will see, uh, make sure, hold on, I need to turn on all of the, I think it's H, right? Yeah. There you go. All right, guys, um, Circle versus Alpha, and we have Hospice. Uh, what do you guys think about Hospice? Um, as a midpoint in general, uh, is it Axe's favorite? Is it Ally's favorite? Um, and even like just what you guys see right now is the the point layout. Do you, do you, do yeah. you guys think it's cursed? <laughs> my op my opinion is like the Axis has a little advantage of the when it, when the middle point is Hospice because the they always get the very north side of the map. Yeah, you can put the, the looks and uh, have tanks there. And it's easier for the access to get their infantry manpowers inside the strong point for the for the ally side. Yeah, it's a little bit difficult, and oh, yeah. don't have any, not have much good gun shooting place. Yeah, and you have to meet grid in the town. Have to just right it here. It will be it will be a very hard time for the infantries for Alpha. What about you, Wix? What are your thoughts of just hospice as a midpoint? Yeah, I agree. Definitely access sided, um, especially for the opening cap. But it is a very recapable point. Um, you know, maybe not some a a as recapable as other points in this map, but when it comes to the, the overall scheme of the game, I think it is a a midpoint where you know you're if you if you don't cap first, uh, you're definitely not locked out. There's definitely uh, you know, ways to to get in there and uh, unlock hospice and, and and take it back if you're the allies or if you lose it uh, first as Axis. I think um, the circle side they have the little bit better uh, next to midpoint. I think route to Haras into hospice is better than hospice into cemetery. So that should play up in uh, circle's advantage if uh, if it comes down to those points, but. Hospice is a good midpoint. It's pretty balanced. Uh, we'll see how it goes in this opening. Um, but it, it should be an interesting uh, point to watch these teams fight over. Yeah. Um, as we have the curtain drop here, it looks like they're not doing any AT gun snipes or not much. The standard double Luke's meta or the double light. 
Uh, but they do uh, have a, re- a solo recon tanker with uh, SL going maybe straight for a cemetery. Yeah, very normal starting, looks like. Doesn't even look like they're doing rocket snipes on the circle side. No, not even. They're just playing it pretty vanilla, I guess you could say. I think they got some uh, rockets on the trucks, transport truck. Let's see. Let's see. So you have you have the four squares, like like Yamamoto was saying. You you have to fight in the town. It's it's pretty bad for both teams once you get pushed out. But Alpha looks like they're getting there really, really quick, though. So. Let's see, as uh, Circle starts to go in the wheat field, you can see the tanks pulling up. You've got one guy probably putting a satchel, maybe? Always waiting Perhaps. for the loops. Oh no, did he, did he just get hit by his own tank? <laughs> Um, Alpha not sending anybody to a uh, pizza slice up here. They just sent the recon tank. You could see the medium, medium for Alpha at the the glider boat. What? Where's where's the Alpha team at? I don't know. They just give up the very north that the uh, the road up the north and let the circle coming straightly. So maybe something happened about the transport truck. I have no idea. All right, as we get in a little bit closer, we do have one OP. You can see uh, Fuyu agent. He is the SL for the pizza slice, but look, like the circle is just, they're not holding the, the lanes here. Well, for for now, they like the Alpha take the the, the town center yeah. of the sector. Looks like, but the, the the circle still holding the middle point, uh, the 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 strong point. So it's still. I think the circle will take the point first. Yeah. But you could also see the SL like kind of waiting to maybe reset here. You know, please just get ready as Alpha is going to cap first especially with the three tanks and the hard cap it's kind of hard to uh hard to counter right <laughs> yeah maybe you can look up the map the circle might do something about the cemetery yeah there's one just one us uh i'm just gonna zoom over there to see if an alpha has anybody in cap sector no they nope they don't they they have europa but he's like, he's he's over here. He's not in cap sector. You it's a, also it's a good news. Yeah, it's a good news that uh, the circle not choosing put the the first supply drop in the cemetery sector. Yeah. That uh, that able wait hold on. Right here. Right here. So right he's gonna now. Be the double drop. I know. Exactly. The double drop. There was a supply truck that went down here, but I think maybe that got taken care of. I saw Probably got hit by the uh, Greyhound a... going the other way, I'd guess. Yeah. yeah. You can see Alpha trying to climb back in the medium, and one loops is still up for Alpha here. Well, watch this. There's too many people. Like... There's too many people at the pizza slice. Uh, yeah, I don't, I'm not sure okay. what's going on. I, I did not oh, know squad. HTD plays for uh, Circle, but. Uh, I knew that they had a co-op with BFTB. Yeah, I, I had heard I had heard about that last week. I don't for some reason we didn't see a lot of the HTD guys playing in our match. Looks like this Sherman's gonna go. Oh, the P4. I think P4 oh, the P4 is up on Pizza Slice Road. Yeah. I think the oh, is this the bait? Oh my God. Oh, he's fucked. Yeah, he might be able to get back into cover here. Okay. I don't know. Say oh. bye bye to the German. That looks bad. 
I think maybe the Sherman might have been looking to push the Lukes and didn't know the Panzer IV was there until it killed the Stuart. Yeah. Uh, and he was kind of committed. Uh, now the Stuart's like, fuck this, I'm getting away from the Panzer IV. Um, yeah, definitely. You can see the map control from Alpha, though. Like, they have full control of the church, which is pretty crucial to defending Cemetery here. Um, they do have a green... This this could be concerning uh, if I were the commander there. You can see the commander on the screen. That's a very bad news. That's a, that's a very bad news. Yeah. So we'll go ahead and stick on a cemetery here, but we'll see if we get a spawn bomb. I mean... Yeah, the, the commander might be able to lock the garrison. He just died, but there's already four squad leaders spawned on it. So that's four OPs they're going to have to clear up here. Yeah. Uh, 4 OP. I think it's 24, 24 people. Oh my god. We're gonna have, to, have to see to... them start falling back. Okay. Oh my god, Rafi. Rafi takes down three before the. Is Alpha that a garrison? Spotter. Yeah, he's right there. Ah, Almost see. had the hero play. They have. If he had been have... able to take the Gary out. Four OPs already on the attack. Um, we should they need to get recon back here to flare this, so they know the extent of how bad this is. It does seem Are like they, going to... they have something over there as well. I think people in the church have to have to go back, respawn on the garrison, whatever the garrison is. Yep, they did. see desperate over there watching the north side but um it looks like alpha is not going too crazy maybe they just rocketed a, a garrison at mason i think they needed to get that garrison at cemetery down faster if they were going to cap it i think it's too late now yeah there's there's only like a short short amount of window right of w when you can do these types of plays you guys think they, the TC just doing the double pushing, like uh, they put pressure on the cemetery and uh, like in the hospice, they will they will push the alpha infantry out of the sector, the hospice sector, and keep that in keep that in I don't know yeah. maybe forever, uh, uh. and uh, then and then the alpha have no chance to get inside the sector of the hospice so they have to find out that's a way like flank or airhead behind yeah whatever this is a a good play from circle because it'll take away the numbers from the front line and then you start to lose like the map control and then, um yeah. but they're they're sending back the steward and then i believe there was wait why is uh tc over here <laughs> what what <laughs> I, I saw him spawn on that garrison and I was wondering what was happening, but I have been trying to figure it out this whole time. Interesting. So I will go back. Uh, you can see Commander Joe. He doesn't. He has supplies over here, but I mean, it'd be pretty ballsy if he had a garrison right here for his guys. Um, so we're gonna go back to uh, hospice. As as you guys could see, with all those people going back to defend cemetery like they're almost like boxed out of the town area yeah it's gonna be tough um when you get boxed out of that area it can be tough to really claw your way back in and it's definitely gonna take a lot of time still obviously a lot of time in the match but oh yeah um you know, the further you get pushed out, the more you got to overcome, the more time it takes, and, and 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 obviously, eventually that becomes an issue. Looks like uh, Popo will be getting pretty close to a OP here. I think he just burnt it. But there was an Alpha OP. Uh, right now, it just seems like Alpha is just trying to clear their their back line still two ops you could see uh a blue zone gary from mayo that's gonna be just in between mason and checkpoint so that's that's pretty far but i think it's uh pretty safe than like putting one like right here 
This is like the typical spot, right? If you're trying to hit up cemetery. Yep. So right yeah. now you can see the the circle is trying to push the is trying to push get the the church right now. Yeah. So it will be very close and very dangerous to Alpha. Yeah, and then Alpha has no members like near the church, you know, not even like an MG at this uh, three story to watch down the lane. Uh, you could yeah. see they still have a little bit of presence up here. Um, their first 76 is here. They're building, you know, the all the tank nests. Uh, let's see where. So we have the Tiger and the opener Panzer IV up at Kansa. But all they're going to do is just like talk shit to each other all day, right? <laughs> they're just going to send one shell be like, all right, I hit you. What are you going to do now? Yeah, Hospice honestly kind of makes for some kind of boring tank play. There's not a whole lot of angles for, for tanks to really engage each other from. So they just will probably sit in common places and trade shots or maybe somebody will double up and, and kill somebody. It's just not it's just not really a tank point, honestly. Uh, infantry got to do the bulk of the work, especially if you're going from like hospice to cemetery. I mean, there's nowhere for... There's there's not a whole lot of that circle tanks can do uh, to kind of help cap cemetery until infantry are kind of knocking on the door already. So right, infantry got to take the first step, and then you know the armor can come in and and support. But it's not like some other points where you know armor can kind of take the lead and just bully the other team off the point. Right. Uh, but with hospice to cemetery being offset, it's you're thinning out the numbers for both teams right i mean you obviously want people in the, the all across the g column for alpha as they if they just stack everybody on the bottom side and push up like rd could kill them and like mg spots could kill them so they're trying to play it pretty good Let's yeah it's see. a tough balance for me if you want to hold cemetery, you have to hold that church area. If you lose like complete control of church, it's almost just a matter of time till cemetery goes down. I mean, maybe Yamamoto has thoughts on it too, but I think that church is critical to cemetery. If you can't control church, then cemetery is like impossible to hold. I don't know what you think. Is that true? That's true. Like to alphas, that alpha have to control both the hosp uh, the church. Yep. And uh, yeah, the G3 and also the G3 sector. Yep, right here. That's like yeah. where like most of like the tank nest and like, you know, you have your launch Gary up there most of the time. I don't know. So if I were yeah, like if I am the commander of the Alpha, I will definitely do some uh, flex flex stuff. Ask some guy, some, some guys to go behind them and try to flank or make a garrison behind the hospice yeah try to yeah what do you guys think about the garrison no network pressure. i mean you can already see one of the the garys lighting up right now yeah. you see europa he's trying to get behind them so this is pretty good uh circle's got a garrison just right here so it might pick him up once he crosses that yellow road Yeah, for me, to my opinion, like uh, Alpha, is, it's not a very good choice to make the make the line a little bit longer than than usual. Mm -hmm. It looks like 800 meter to 1,000 meters looks right right now. Yeah. So to so if yeah, like if you are doing the same situation, you have to make the enemy infantry, the manpower, out of their sector. And try and try to do a sudden attack. Yeah. To make the to make the progress. Take it out of the garrison and let your infantry go inside and uh, wipe everything out. Mm. It seems like Circle has physical control of the church, but uh, Alpha, they're just right there. I'm not sure what they're doing. Okay, so 
maybe they're putting their numbers up here and these guys are shift Wing while these guys are just like holding well looks i to me i'm thinking yeah like they just uh have to defense you know they are forced to defense the the line yeah. because infantry is everywhere so yeah they are making a little bit of progress over here but you can see like the mg you see radio and like templar um they've lost control of this uh farmhouse though they're trying to push but it's very hard uh, especially with uh little armor support right now i think the second heavy should be coming up there you go for the second heavy you can see uh you see alice uh, who's in this one? Oh, he probably died. Uh, it's in the middle. There's another P4 in sector F4. Yeah. Right here. Yep. This is Lord. Lord Dax. Lord Dax. But you can see, even down the main road, they're they're, they're making progress. Uh, Adore. Who did Adore you see? Adore used to play for, for FLC, right? Fuck. Yeah, right. Okay, okay. He was a exactly. SL as well? He is. Okay. Some of the names I could... Uh, it looks familiar, at least the uh, English names. Yeah, uh, the For You agent, you just speak, yeah. you just spoke. And he's also from uh, FLC. FLC right here. Like, yeah, right now. You can actually see somebody wearing the FOC tag if you look to the left side. Yeah. Uh, Hakushu. <laughs> yes. Long live FOC. Uh, <laughs> yeah, FOC is everywhere right now. They're just, uh, like you said in seasonal chat, right? Um, uh, FOC is just, uh, I think it's like hibernating yes. right now. <laughs> yes. Taking a break. Where did the FOC tankers end up? They are... At holiday, on holiday. <laughs> oh. And, but, but... They, I think, I think they put the... Their steam, uh, I don't know. I think they joined a Alpha. If, if, if you see the roster, check the roster list of Alpha, I think. Yeah. I think they joined Alpha. Because I have said... I have said? Yes. After yeah. They might not be playing playing today right now, but yeah, um, we can see, let's see which player we have. Who's on uh RD? I think, I, I think it's Legion that's playing RD today for Circle. Yeah, Legion is playing RD for Circle. Um, oh my god, dude, like, just look at, like, what we're looking at, there's, it's like a, it's like a mix of blue, blueberries and red dots, some yeah, people behind each other, yeah, like, uh, Alpha tries their best to make a line of infantry, yeah, trying to their best, I think if you look at where the state of the game was like 10 minutes ago, Alpha looked really on their back foot like they were lucky to hold on to Cemetery. And and while I don't think it's great for them, I think they've got to be pleased that they've with with what they've accomplished in kind of getting back into into some of these key areas. Obviously the the reset to save Cemetery, you know, lost them some ground but they didn't get fully boxed out and they've really been able to rebound in a way that keeps them in this game it's definitely not looking good for them the circle is is uh solidly in control but i think if you went if you went back 10 minutes and uh looked at where alpha was i think you got to be a little bit pleased with with where they are right now that they've been able to uh to hold as much ground as they have oh my god I didn't even know you can get on this roof. It's a nice little spot. But as uh, Wix, Wix just said, yeah, 
I mean, they were they were on the back foot. They had like Circle had like four OPs where like O five was at, and they're not committing too much to to like go too wide. I mean, they they set a MG down here, but nothing in the back line. Circle they lost their garrison right here, but it's it's more of like a stalemate. I think they're they're just trying to like push out of the church. Uh, they did take control somewhat of the farmhouse again. You can see two SLs resetting. But a uh, circle, circle trying to uh, fight in the town. And get in here. They... This, might, this might still be the original Panzer IV. Yeah. I don't know that this tank has died. It's Lord Jax's tank squad. He's getting value. Uh, the other tanks, they are playing, they're both playing pizza right now. So they're playing pretty passive. Uh, even though Circle has all this like map control. I know it's like a, it's dangerous to uh, send, send a tank and uh, SME. Yeah, I mean, it's, <clears throat> I wouldn't even necessarily call that passive. That's about as far up as you can go on hospice yeah and what what the pizza slice allows you to do is kind of shoot onto the front door on that main road uh which you can't do if you're playing like the north south uh red road so they're kind of doing as much as they can until their infantry take more ground like there's no other tank spots past this unless like you said they go into the city yeah so the tanks are up like as far as they can go you can see they're looking down towards the road so they're going to make it hell for anybody trying to make it up that road, force them onto the south side. Um, and, and that's what they can do right now. Like I said, this is not a, a great map where, or a great point where, where tanks can necessarily have a huge impact a lot. So they're doing what they can, I think. Right. It does look like one of the alpha tankers uh, went up a 2v1 or, or something while we were out in the city so alpha losing that tank battle north see there is there one is in the wheat field to the right a medium the spawn medium and in the wheat field right there's a 76 but he probably wants nothing to do with the north side of the road knowing that there's those two tigers and pizza oh yeah garrison here for alpha i mean an hour and four minutes I'd like to see Alpha, you know, get one of those guys, map it, just go all the way, like maybe down to B, B sector and like, I don't know, get an OP over here or something. Rockets, one of these, you know, that's, I'm speaking um, pretty optimistic here, but I, I think it's yeah. definitely possible. Yeah, a tiger so something down destroyed, or yeah. What Repair station, maybe, if not a tiger. Oh. It's a tiger. It is a tiger. What the hell killed that? AT gun. And uh, perhaps another 76? Yes. Caught him out a little bit, maybe? So maybe this, where's uh, the other tiger? The other tiger went south. Is this moving? Oh, yeah. okay. Oh, oh my god. Why is, why is he over here? <laughs> that. Uh, whoa, that is very aggressive. He's looking for the 76, 76 in the wheat field. Got one shot. Uh, he got one, 76 got one shot. Oh, can you shoot through that? Not hedge? the second. That, 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 possibly. No these these hedges here are oh, not. Oh, he's done. Oh, what is he doing? Why? Where's he oh, going? No. Why? <laughs> no. <laughs> totally no crew about this movie. So, right so now. So, I want to ask. Oh, go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. I was gonna say I wanted to ask y Yamamoto a question. Yeah. So as as a commander, you you lose the midpoint, you're down to three. What what do you what are you asking your armor to do at that point? Do you want them to, you know, be aggressive and try to kill enemy tanks? Do you want them to stay alive and you know get a healthy number of heavy yeah. tanks up? What what do you think armor should be doing down two three generally? Like like to me, the first thing is if if we are two three. And uh, the, the best, the most important thing is the tanks must be safe. Yes. You have to be safe. Because tank in this game is very important. 
it will it just like uh, destroy every infantry of the on the map if if you have a if if you have a chance. And like as a as a commander, the first of uh, the first ten minutes, I will I will see uh, the infantry is our infantry is bad, better or worse. Mm. So I can adjust my strategy for the next seventy uh, next uh, one hour. Okay, okay. If I'm in this circumstances, I will definitely put tanks in safe place. But it also depends on the map. So. How far right now they are doing? Yeah, just three tanks in the point. What can I say? <laughs> so they have a a duo, and then they have one just tank right there. Um, while you guys were talking, the medium actually killed the uh, tiger right here in the southeast gardens. But, the side plate, right? Yeah. Uh, so that's good work from the medium. Alpha still has one more heavy, should be right there. But just uh, to the right, I think in the wheat. Oh no, that's the medium. Sorry. Yeah. yeah but the circle is starting. Take oh, the, the cemetery. Oh yeah, they have uh, uncontested OP. Wow. Just right here. They have the garrison ready for Rousseau, so we'll, we'll see how Alpha. That's I don't for think... the whisk kick. I don't think this is a big threat. I think Alpha's going to stuff this out. I think you already see the response. They got to get that OP, obviously, but. But I think there are three tanks, mini tanks in the, in the point for Alpha. Uh, for Alpha. Yes. So the, the tanks, the tanks will give some, uh, will buy the, will buy Alpha many times. Some some time. Uh, much time. Yeah, yeah, sometimes they need to defense the symmetry. As much as you don't like losing those 76s in the north, you know, it, it at the very least you're looking at it and they are getting the tigers down as well, which is good because, you know, even if you're trying to stack your tanks on defense and get multiple up, you, you, you don't really want them to get too many heavies up and just able to camp that midpoint either. Right. So, if if you're losing tanks as alpha, I I I, don't, I agree with uh, you know what Yamamoto was saying. You don't really you want your tanks to be safe as, if you're down. But I guess it, at least the silver lining there is they're taking some tigers with them, which is going to prevent Circle from getting you know too comfortable with just a bunch of tanks sitting around hospice that there's nothing you can really do about later in the game. that circle scare uh is it too much you could see the tiger is playing trying to look for the 76 um the medium playing the farmhouse road i'm not i don't think it's marked yet from the circle because that tiger is not going for it <clears throat> tiger is a little bit afraid of another 76 so yeah he might he might know about it but doesn't know where their 76s are we yeah. have uh, SX and his uh, tank crew just playing up here. I think they should be... So the fuel for Circle is uh, two heavies right now. They they obviously have one loot, but he's kind of just watching the, the main road as a solo. I thought I At remember seeing... IT, ITK tags down there. Shout out ITK. <laughs> Best hella loose team named after an anime character. Uh, yeah. It's... uh. That was it. Itsuka's clan, right? Yeah, Itsuka Katori. Yeah. Now, now playing for uh, ESPT. ESPT. So far, yes. the the circle and alpha game, it's kind of just been a stalemate. Um, you know, alpha having a little bit more gaps where circle is able to uh expose and maybe get like a op to just scare them like a like a false cap um, yeah like the circle make some uh, made some uh, the especially the tank squad make some mistakes lost uh, i don't know maybe lost two tanks 
not necessary and let Alpha make some progress in the middle. Yeah. And also Alpha doing some great. They, they they know how to use the tanks. But if the if the circle put a P4 or Tiger to to, to, like to attack cemetery. the cemetery from yeah from from south cemetery from south side, yeah. it will be very deadly. Especially if you you know you you know as an axis player the the seventy sixes will play up here because uh, they're trying yeah. to put pressure onto hospice and you know at least make one of the tigers play against them. But if they do send like a one of those standards, oh it looks like yeah I think they're doing it. <laughs> no, no idea, no idea. Are they watching this stream? No. No, it's uh, we're no, we're we're, we're obviously to... on a thirty minute delay, but yeah. uh, maybe yeah, they're yeah, reading your mind. Oh my god! Uh, great minds think alike. I should huh? shut up. <laughs> um, the church is just like a never ending battle of like both teams. You could see the steward has kind of moved up to kind of try to help it. All these like backyard fighting is like a. It's like an SME special, right? Whenever you're playing SME, you, you know, um, left leaning against like a STG is like probably one of the worst. You see like Alpha and the, uh, the Circles infantry in the, in the church, see, just like, I don't know, the Alpha seems, seems to pushing doors perhaps, but uh, also Yeah, it looks like Alpha started yeah. getting more control north of the church yeah. and less control south. So they got to kind of balance that because obviously north you get closer to hospice. But if you don't get to hospice, then the people south of church are going to be an issue. Yeah. Once was a box out. Now you can see the guys are trying to get in there, but at the cost of, you know, like, look, you're you're so thin on um, defense, and uh, Circle also has. Well, I think they're looking to push oh, one that's, of the tigers. And that's not a good idea. Yeah, that's not good. Good news for Alpha. Yep, the TC, the Circle is putting two tanks to the south side. They are making, perhaps, they are trying to make a very big move, a very big strike. From right. south, and all the alpha tanks, heavy tanks, are at the north side, very north side of the map. It's, it's, they can't support the cemetery. Oh my Ooh. god, a peace strike! Jesus Christ! Nice one. The tiger? <laughs> yeah, that's a tiger. <laughs> tiger oh. gets peace strike by alpha's commander, so. Um, what that's that's probably a call from the the tc right that had to be uh very well could have been or maybe a recon a recon plane i'm not sure if recon plane came over but true yeah it could be the classic hey i hit this guy he's repairing go get him oh so with that peace strike it looks like uh low Jax is sending his tiger back to hospice yeah because they don't have any heavy tank support in the sector right uh, as of right now, I believe we only have seen this 76. Uh, you can see the commander, he's on the wing. Um, I don't know where the other one is at. Where was that medium? Oh no! Oh, he's limping back. Is Ronin? It doesn't matter if Ronin has rockets. So, the fuel is not a it's, problem. I think it's pretty even right now. They, they've they got two two heavies on the board for each, you know, maybe one a little further than the other. Yeah. Can we see the scoreboard for, for a second? Okay. Let's go check it out. Yeah, let's, let's see. Let's see the, the results of the tanks. Uh, so... We'll look at the CE for the tank squads. Uh, you can see 347 for one for circle. Uh, let me see, where's the other one for circle? Uh, almost the 1k. 
1,000. Maybe um, two tanks destroyed. Yeah. Let's see. So Saga, Saga, and this guy. No, there's gotta be more. Yamamoto uh, would be yeah, a little the, bit better. The, the, yeah, Ado, Ado Fu is 400. Yes, he he is a he is a tank squad leader. Oh, okay. Also, okay. and uh, and the guy has 434 level. Also, yeah. 434. This guy is also a yeah. This guy is also a squad leader, tank squad leader. And SX is also. I think there's a three tank squad they have. Wait, where did in this game? Where did this tank come from? So they have three. So Alpha, where where this one go? Uh, it might have been him that made it up there. The one that we saw limping out of church oh, now up right. at. Uh... Okay, so there is three. So they so do have, have the a little fuel tank. advantage, right? Yeah. The good news. And the tiger's just uh, driving north out of hospice now. He arrived. But there's going to be a couple 76s watching there. You can see the other tiger is coming up map edge right now. Uh, it's Arnie's tank, but... but... But look at the edge 3. It's it's not a good news for the Alpha. The, the, the circle built a uh, garrison at edge 3. Very top side, north side. Oh no, and now uh, SX is satcheled. Too many of them. Too many of them. Three guys with statue. All the, right here. This oh game. wow. This this is not good. And it's uh, it's not good. Definitely not good. So, I mean that you need you need those kind of plays from your infantry when your armor gets down a little bit. Circle's armor was a little bit on the back foot. Infantry's gotta you know make a couple plays to help even it up. Yeah. I think this P4 won't be too much of a problem since the, uh, one of the 76s is, is at Cemetery Yamamoto. Yeah. Um, yes. Unless people have to wait. Unless this guy Papo is able to get a satchel onto. You. Yeah, but I don't know. Maybe, maybe the the P4 got a bit good positioning. Oh, okay. Oh, he's Never gonna mind. satchel the Gary. Oh, and he built it at the same area too. <laughs> Probably like honestly 50 50 that that satchel even takes down the garrison. Satchels are so like finicky right now. You never really know what the hell they're gonna even do. The only thing you know satchels are gonna do is kill infantry. Beyond that, it's like. Let's see, who knows? It take the. It does. It got yes. it, yeah. yeah. Yes. Uh, it should. Like, don't get me wrong. It should, but. Man, satchels, you never know. Apologize for being all over the, the place, guys. Um, now they have to clean their ass from behind. It's too annoying. Yeah, that was a great play because Alpha was starting to make some progress front door, right. and they get that garrison behind them and just clear them out. Like the tanks had to leave, the infantry now are are uh, having to cup fall back a little bit. So that was a great play, even How though the Gary's gone down. Old cat. Oh. How he get there? <laughs> no idea. Maybe from the south. Go back. He might make a play on that tank if he can stay hidden. Airhead dropping in from Joe, uh, Brother Sun Tun. <laughs> um, plus a bombing run. So Circle is making a move. They're playing aggressive. They they don't want to sit around and just just keep it uh, three two. I mean, they're not losing much, right? It's 47 minutes. They still have time to like make mistakes, even though like this doesn't work. It might work though. There's nobody near it. Yeah. Oh my God, that bomb run is very good. Very good. The tank's still there. That's we do very have good. that one squad but leader. Tent can support it unless he we... he's he's pushing. If he's pushing to the to 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 destroy the the, the get their head so or it won't make a big progress. Cancer four it. went down. The airhead is clear. Oh, Got a big oh, spawn with. Oh. Okay. Who was get that? Bombed. The rocket. <laughs> get bombed. 
That was that guy right there. Bad luck. Hilarious, because the airhead was clear too. So they got like 10 people spawn on it thinking that it's all good. But that spawn wave from that uh, garrison or OP North just came in at the right time. Ambition and uh, Mao, Mauder. He's getting close to an OP. Or maybe he, he burnt it already. Some nice, nice frag right there. Let's see. So that attack has been gone, but look. We have people behind the circle. Hakushu. He's weighing. He smells it. He wants it. Two tanks, two targets. I wonder if he's rocket or satchel, because if he's rocket, which it looks like he is, he's got a rifle. Did There's only see? so much he can do. Oh, he Did doesn't oh. see. He didn't see. Why? Oh my god. You can see the 76 out in the distance. Wait, what? The smoke? That's a medium? It's a show of uh, 75, yeah, perhaps. Oh yeah, medium. Um, I don't know where all the the 76 is went. I know there was one at cemetery now. Yeah, the last wave, the last wave uh, from behind of the circle, they just, uh, you know. Up back here. Yeah, force the force the 76 have to oh, he's... move around. No, that's still. Maybe he got satchel or I don't see a carcass anywhere. No, it's just not too much going on. Um, we're still fighting for a farmhouse, and then still no complete control of the uh, south of like SME or the actual chapel church. But nothing yet. I I haven't seen Alpha try to do like a airhead or. Maybe send somebody out because it it yeah, feels it like, looks like a little bit. they've they've just been like you know uh, backpedaling this whole game since the opener. Yeah, it looks a little bit weird because Alpha is good at flanking and uh, yeah, you don't trying see any to do Alpha something flanking. from behind. Uh, yeah, I didn't see anything from behind, but now they're playing for a classic Chinese strategy of wait for the last ten minutes and bonds out. <laughs> <laughs> We got, we, got, we got 34 minutes. Alpha's just got to hold 2-3 for 34 minutes, and then then they then they unleash the, the bonsai. <laughs> it's still able to happen. Maybe they're just mentally uh, um, wearing out uh, the circle yeah. right now, thinking that, all right, uh, circle, we'll let you have the first, you know, you know the, the first 80 minutes of the game. Uh, yeah. The last 10, you better, you better hold your balls and... Be ready. 276s. So this is a very safe spot right now for the 76s. Um, circle. They have two OPs over here, but they're not committing too much people. Um, they actually but I, have pushed up over, over here. Yeah, like I said. Uh... The, the TC got the pressure on the very north side of the map, so the Alpha's tank have to have to back and defend the cemetery because it's not safe. Right. You can see a door trying to work with his squad to clear this area for them, but for the meantime. What do you call? What do you call the very north side of the map? That the two houses uh, field. This area. Which what? What yeah. do we call it? I don't know. I just call this like, like map edge, man, MG house. That's yeah, me, I don't, I don't, me MG personally. house, whatever. Yeah, yeah MG I house. Do. Let's we call it MG house. Yeah, it's, it's this place. This spot is very important for for for, uh, for the MGs and also yeah the allies. It's very important. If you don't have this point, it's it's no way to uh, A charge hospital? inside the uh, yeah exactly. I checked the official Helios call-out sheet, and we call that dual houses. Dual house. Dual houses. Yeah, okay. dual house. Because there's two. Uh, <laughs> yeah. 
I think I've only like looked at that sheet like once. No, I widow. I look at that all the time. Uh, that was just one that I forgot. Thank you for that. And you're gonna make him cry. The man's got a broken hand. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Shout outs to Widow, one of our uh, leads at at Helios. Um, so two seventy sixes. They've got the Stewart back there. Um, Ronan trying to make a play right here. Ronan, former GXV. Former GXV. Uh, Shout out. Sneaky, sneaky. Boyd, no also. He, he's using MP40, MP40 or? Yeah, okay. MP40. MP40. Oh. Medium. Ah, uh, he gave up. <laughs> gave up. Oh, yeah, he did. Do you think that tank's gonna catch these two? Walking? Oh my god, why is he looking back? I think he he see definitely see 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 the first the first seventy six. And he definitely got the information of those tanks. Those are two seventy six. Oh my god. Okay. Duck the You gotta back up bro, he got the, first hit. Oh he, he, he this might be close, it's close. No 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 he's, no. He's gonna be able to hit him in the oh. turret at least. Nope. Yeah. Bye bye. Bye the bye. elevation that edge, he needed to go forward. Unfortunately, he had yeah. to keep going forward. That's very unfortunate. Um, you know, in that tank, they're they're swearing because the first tank made it through. Well, the, shot. <laughs> the, the second one. Gets the first it. tank will take the revenge. No. We do have another one right here next to like the like eight squads. Three they got three tanks right now. The DC, perhaps, yeah. They got yeah. three tiger. I don't know what's what's the call because like he's right here. The tanks obviously know that he's here as well, since they killed the one behind him. I'm not sure if they did, if they saw the first one or not. Well, obviously they did. He, he's marked. He, yeah. We'll see. They he's got to be first. careful. He's got to be careful because they might be trying to pull these two tigers up together. That's something we haven't really seen is two tanks on either side working in in close proximity to try to double double tap, uh, double tap a uh, an enemy tank. We haven't really seen that yet. Um, but you got to think with the two tigers in that area, they might think about it. They got good information on this one uh, in the wheat field. There's a lot of room to operate there. And really, they could be peeking for it right now. I mean, you can see they're kind of looking down that same gap, potentially. One from the road. Yeah. Is going to do something? And the then the one is going to do something? Oh, no. the second tiger. Oh, there we go. My God. Right, as I, my right as I said that we hadn't seen it, they uh, they pull it off. Very wonderful coordination. Work for a nice awesome. double tap right there. Um, I mean, the fuel situation for the circle is... No, Alpha. Look at cemetery. Look at cemetery. Oh city. my God, Jesus Christ! This is Alpha. Have no no heavy tank right now. Yeah. This, yeah. Right after the two. Time. Right after the two that, heavy tanks that left. Two, that two tanks moving is just I don't know. Ooh, it might be the last OP got camped. Ambition's the last one. I think that OP Lens went had to have gone down. Lens is coming. They've got two front door OPs. They've got T squad. That's you know, if any tank tries to come up, they could. They just them. called in an airhead right in front of Rousseau too. So okay. if this cap goes That's through, there's going to be an airhead. That might be a police kick. They're getting ready for it. You can see the SLs going. Saga is back here though. Let's see if he actually looks up and. No, uh, he's pushing front. Forward. Big spawn wave off of the Big Gary. It's not enough. It, it not stalled enough. it for a second, but they're got to be looking to get into the hard point and maybe drop reinforce. I don't know if well, any force has been used. That's gonna not be good though. It's definitely not good. Hope the tank do something. Stewart is still Stewart there. limping, limping back. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like he might be tracked because he is moving extremely slowly. Yeah, track is damaged. He's got to be sending shells, man. Oh. You got to just be. 
That's a very big spawn wave. Very That's a save wave. wave. Let's. Oh my god. Let's Holy see if they can get in shit. there. You can see Florian. Florian SW. It's gonna be the hero. Not the hero. He's not that guy. <laughs> He's not, he's, he's not that guy. <laughs> wow, this actually looks really good for Alpha already, even though it's, it's still 80% capped. Yeah. This actually looks like a pretty good response. Bombing run coming in for uh, the circle right here. Should be able to get that Gary in the, the farmhouse. Oh, that's, that's Alpha's bombing run? Plus. Oh, that. Yeah. I think the problem, or the reason that uh, Circle wasn't able to cap Cemetery, is they just didn't have a garrison close enough that once it started to get past, like, half, they really couldn't go all in. There was no spawn for them to use. The Airhead might have been able to do it, but the Airhead went for Rousseau instead of Cemetery, and all Circle could pump in to Cemetery was two OPs. They had no garrisons nearby. There was no ability to really go all in and when you saw alpha go all in on defense it was able to counteract them right so. and oh my god look one tiger two tiger defense tiger and they have 600 fuel so this is a uh a bold call from um circle but i mean they they have the fuel advantage right a huge one and I, and I and I can't imagine what kind of ground they just picked up with that huge spawn wave of Alpha coming back. I mean, Alpha had to have lost. They didn't really have great map control before that. Right. And it's got to be even worse now. I mean, essentially, they were, like, hanging on by a thread in, in the north. They're, they're fighting over there. Like, you can see E-squads still fighting up yeah. there. Uh, but now with... You know, one tank in the church, and then one tank far south. I think from south here, can you shoot into the cemetery? There's like yes. somewhat of an angle, right? Not, not. Qu there is a little bit from the red road, but yeah. not quite where that one is, just because of Look. the curvature. I think. Look, right. if you, if you, you can shoot the cemetery. Like uh, you don't need, you don't have to see the enemy. You just shoot the turret, shoot down the trees or walls. You, you get some kills. But I see, like the circle just lost the uh, lost the garrison at the very top side of the hospice. Oh yeah, E three. Ah, we with somebody. Yeah, my man. Here we go. Know, I'm not gonna cast to them. <laughs> we'll just <laughs> we'll just go back. You know what I'm saying? I'm okay, looking for okay. that interesting game. You know, I I, I believe in the caster curse, man. You, you can't say their name. You can't do any of that. Oh. Uh, Long range shots. Oh no, that's a 76 too. What was it? Or was that? The mini. No. Medium. Oh. No, it was a heavy. No, it's a 76. Oh no, they lost. Oh, man, he must have. He must have just got there too. Like he must have just arrived. So you can see the circle's defense is going there. They yeah. know something is up. But we'll see but if alpha just, they could wrap. You can see the alpha. Alpha just lost whole north side of the map. Oh my god! Yeah, they're pushed back to like, the glider. Yeah. Oh my god! This, this yeah, looks it's fun. the it's AA artillery. So it's no place for the tanks, alpha tanks, to attack or or I don't know. Make support for the infantry. Yeah. Do they ha do they have tanks? <laughs> yeah, that's, a, <laughs> that's another another problem. Oh, there was a the tank that was at the church is no, it's not dead. He just went up, right? Yeah, he just went up. Uh, so they're only committing one right now. Um, I, I like the tank in the south though. He is he is able. I was kind of wrong earlier. He is getting some angles on his cemetery. Obviously, got that seventy six kill, but. This is good. It's going to be a kind of a new wrinkle if uh, Circle starts to get some pressure on Cemetery again to have that tank in the area because Cemetery is a pretty open spot, so so tanks can have a big effect here using the open fields to their advantage. Oh my God, dude! So I'm assuming that the T Squad they're just there to annoy all of the tanks. There are two right? mines before before them. Yeah. It, yeah. 
75 might walk directly on the mines, perhaps. Two mines in front of them. No, oh, okay. Uh... Okay. All right. He's well, clear. You can see the north side. I mean, artillery battery is already controlled by um, the circle here. Uh, they obviously don't have farmhouse. Uh, it'd be a good idea for them to like at least put an MG up here, but you can see uh, Fuyu, he's he's in there. He's not lighting up any OPs or anything. Um, but you can see kind of like a little smiley face for uh, the circle here. Uh, they did lose the OP for the sabotage. And I mean, they have guys that are just running across the field right now, so... I hope um, Alpha can can clean this up and then maybe put their uh, tanks in a more safe spot. They've got a medium here on defense. They've got a recon tank as well. But it's, I mean, Circle Circle has have been have been doing it pretty good though. Their their infantry have been pushing um, for the most part and making some plays for themselves. They just need, um, you know, like a little, like piggyback from from armor, and then I think they they could probably um, take cemetery easy peasy. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's the one thing that could be the difference. Again, I mean, I think they would have capped it last time if they had a team spawn to just you know pump people in there yeah uh, but with just the two ops it just wasn't enough to overcome i don't even mean that as a criticism it's just kind of how they were set up they haven't been right. getting the garrisons real close up front uh and they have been successful but then you see uh you know what the downside of that can be as well circle um trying a new strategy i haven't seen this before no commander right now for circle interesting <laughs> well, um, maybe just lost connection <laughs> Joe Batherson to probably no, taking he's in a tank, there. maybe. Yeah, he's... What is... Okay, that's something new. What is he doing exactly? Let's see if we can find Joe. You can use... Uh, you, guys... you, can, you can do the search if you want to. Yeah, use the scoreboard. Hit, hit home and then enter. Oh, okay. And then you can, you can search him by name. <laughs> and, and then Dead. click... And then, Bottom, yeah, he's dead. Yeah, he's he was dead. Engineer? It's engineer. Maybe they lost some nodes. Did they lose some nodes? Maybe he's rebuilding nodes. Is that allowed to destroy nodes? Yeah, no way. I don't think yeah. so. Yeah, you're allowed to destroy nodes in seasonal. You yeah. are. Yeah, last I checked. No, no, no. I you thought. Don't. Uh, nah, I thought well, it was. I gotta, I gotta reread the rules and correct some people <laughs> who I told me. <laughs> yeah. you can destroy nodes. Oh, <laughs> somebody's somebody's going sneaky to attack. What is uh? What is this? What is this player's name? Yeah, it's uh. ITK. Main March seventh. It's very lovely. Oh. That's his name. Oh, another he heavy is gonna die. Did he statue the tiger? Yeah, yeah, he yeah. Did. He got a statue on it. Okay. I don't think they have any idea either. There's another tank. Alice's tank is all the way south right now. You can see. Oh, maybe back. they do. He's going for it. They're... See it. See it? No! I think they're repairing. They're repairing. They don't know it's satchel. <laughs> Hell no. Oh my god. So right now, Alpha, you can see uh, SX. His tank is right there. I think all the way south right here, you can see the other tank. Oh, dude, they're going to lose another heavy. Ronin is coming back yeah. too. SX might go directly for him. Or... Oh, he's turning. He's yeah. Going. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's go. He's he's going, going looking, look after for him. Emo fish is following the tank. <laughs> I think. <laughs> is that his name? Yeah. Uh, that's the emo fish alpha. Emo fish. On the very. Yeah. Okay. Wasn't that the guy that we saw back behind hospice too? Yes, he. I think he is. A, he dead. is. A, what I called is the information spot. Uh, so the, the guy is the guy just go behind the enemy line and uh, use his scope 
to find where enemy garrison and tank is and give information. That's the only thing he do. Never shoots anybody unless he has to. Yeah, or, yeah, or something. yeah. Oh no, Alpha loses another tank. And the uh, running out the garrison to southeast of cemetery. Yeah. But the garrison used like to be right here. I, yeah, I was in the corn. How did he die? No idea. He didn't look like he was damaged, then he died to one shot, I thought, so I don't really know what happened there. I saw his turret on fire, but... Um... Oh, okay. Maybe I missed that. Hey. Maybe yeah. get one shot? I don't know. This looking a little dicey for... Maybe, uh... Satchel somewhere? Yep. Yes. And cleared. But you can see the control that circle. What the fuck? Oh, my, what the fuck? Oh, that's a little bit dangerous. <laughs> Fu you coming in clutch, man. Because he was like south down here, but I'm not sure. You could probably expect a recon spotter to come up right now. And the tiger's moving out of hardcap. Yeah, I mean, they still got all their spawns, though, so... Yeah. Unless they move quickly and maybe get this one in the north wheat field. Um, I don't know that they're going to be able to do much off of this, except maybe pull some circle people back if they can get some uh, cap weight or some cap progress going. Yeah. Hospice lighting up. Two OPs near here. You can see Ken, Ken Fuchs. Trying to do what he can. Um, I don't think it's too concerning right now. We'll see. There's OPs in here. Uh, I'm surprised there's no AT spawn. The other tank shooting to help. 76 is shooting it from south. He didn't yeah, engine it though. Yeah. To no, clear was, the was, infantry. It's a friendly. Yeah, it, it was his own. Oh, you're right, you're right, you're right. My bad. It's a friendly the tiger to clear the clear the infantry. For him. I do want to keep an eye on this. As you can see, Medic and Enzo. Start to he got OP. He, he, know, he know where the OP is. No. Oh, he does get fragged, so. Yeah. We'll see, Fuyu is still in the three story right now. Uh, but, but look, now they have uh, control of this. 24 minutes, I think anything can happen. I'm not gonna say too yeah, much. Yeah, and I think, I think, you know, you don't see that attack being successful, but at the same time, you can see down here, Circle's kind of setting up for an attack on the cemetery. So those, those people that had to fall back are now really not available to push cemetery hard so there's it's it's zero sum right you got 50 guys you pull guys out of one area that means fewer people available for another area so even when you don't see these these small little attacks succeed in taking the point it's still pulling bodies and can still uh make a difference and, and help regain some lost ground right so this is really good now they have people at the farm house and then they have people over there um, Alpha, even though they are pretty down bad on fuel, I mean, they have a medium right there just out in the distance is the 76 pulling up, uh, 23 minutes. I think maybe they focus on defending cemetery first and then, um, I don't know. Uh, I haven't seen them try to airhead yet, but, um, you got to start thinking about some plan to try to take hospice. Yeah. Right. There's there's no points for, you know, there's no benefit to like a you know a three two loss, right? So you, you got to come up with something. It might not be a great plan. It might not be likely to succeed. But you got to start now figuring out. I think what like what is our what is our one shot going to be? Are we going to try to just you know hide our seventy sixes, try to get two or three of them up, and just push? Are we going to try to set up? You know some kind of airhead and so you got to get some garrisons down or something or at least know where they are you know what is the what is the final push going to be here i think is 
the point where Alpha is getting to. They got to figure out what that's going to be because they're not really knocking on the door of hospice right now. They got to figure out what what their shot's going to be. You can see the two okay. MG spots right there, really nice spots uh, that you could shoot into cemetery from. That machine gun is killing everybody. <laughs> Hellfish. <laughs> yeah. What do you guys think so far? Uh, Wix and Yamamoto? Just from the opener until now. How's uh, Alpha doing? Um, what you'd like to see within the, the last 20 minutes from both of you guys? What's your uh, thoughts? Circle did some very good uh, movement of strategy. Like the first uh, 10 minutes, the out the able team put the garrison behind the enemy line and the led four squad leader uh, step behind the cemetery as the first. And the second is like I don't know I don't know who which squad leader is. Oh, who, yeah, he drove he drive the supply truck long from south to the north and build a garrison also to this yeah to destroy the i don't know like uh he destroyed the build op from north and uh, clear the tanks yeah. at the dual house north side that's pretty pretty smart moves i can say and alpha they they are pretty tough you have to say Mm -hmm. Like every time, every time the second cemetery got got uh, pushed by the circle, circle. they always fight yeah, back. they always keep fight back and uh, success. That's a very important thing. Yeah, it's looking uh pretty dangerous here for for Alpha. You can see out in the distance there is the the Gary, so we might be expecting a spawn bomb. I think that medium went down. Was that a medium that went down south side of cemetery? Yeah. Just yeah, a moment ago. There's still the 76 on the east side. But a lot of blue here, not a lot of red. Too many blue here. Might be. Might need a bombing run. We do have one of the tigers coming up. Uh, we also have another tiger playing, um, playing the farmhouse. So, one going back to hard cap. Circle looking strong right now as they have the hard cap circle. I mean, pretty much the inside of cemetery locked down. Now let's see if they get if if they've gotten the uh, garrisons down because it looks like no. There's still one in the corn there because we just saw some squad leaders spawning there. So I think if Ronan can get this garrison down, that'll seal the cap. He blows up. What was that even? I have no idea. A truck? I think it was an Wait. empty truck. He's Wait. burning OPs. He's going to hear that garrison. There he goes. Oh my god. That's Dang. not good. That should seal the deal. I think. Bomb yeah. Out. 76 is moving in, but not very well supported. I don't know how long he's going to last. This bombing gun. There. Oh, it's going to go out of its way to no, miss. No, oh, no, no. That's, that's not good. That's not hey, good. Oh it my got a few people, but not enough. <laughs> oh shit! Oh my god! So at the very last minute, oh. Alpha's fighting back with the with enough spawns right now, especially with the tank. I believe the tank is in the circle. Yes. Oh, and um, as as he gets out. <laughs> but there's a but there's another tiger at the north side of him. I don't know. He's why he's reversing. Peace strike is coming in. Let's put this in your strike. Uh, okay. Classic. Stuka's still bad. Classic yeah. Stuka bad. Uh, <laughs> it's not. It's not Joe's positioning. It's just the actual Stuka itself. It's it like it's never late hits. war. It's it's late war realism where the Germans are using Luftwaffe pilots that that can't actually see. <laughs> <laughs> they had to lower the um, threshold for 
for eyesight requirements for the uh, the Luftwaffe pilots and the Stuka just doesn't hit shit anymore. <laughs> I think as of right now, like Circle, they're just gonna keep pressing the fourth point right now. Um, I don't think there's much going on at Hospice. You can see the, the spread and the box out from the Circle uh, giving to uh, Alpha right now. but. I mean, Adore and then uh, Fu is probably trying to find a way, but, you know, everybody's in a nice position to where they can yeah. cover, you know, open fields, basically, and main roads. Yeah, the circle got three OP inside the cemetery, and there's another garrison behind, right? Yeah. I mean, Buddy well, should be like feasting on this right now if they see that on a, yeah, a flare. This alpha, alpha is just trying to do whatever they can to. The the tank fight will be very important for both team. If the who wins the tank fight, who will get the point? I would say. Did he know? Oh, it's coming. He's co Statue. Yeah, it's a statue. You saw yeah. it? Okay. Okay. Then. Where was the first hit from? Was it a uh, rocket? Or... It's from. No, no, it's from the tank. Oh. From the tiger. He got the. I don't know if he hit the body or not. But the statue kills the tank eventually. Alright, so. Yeah. Uh, circle sending both tigers in now. Onto the oh, uh, western field and the southern field. Uh, unfortunately, Alpha, uh, I think they they got no tank support. They got no tank supports. I they, they've been sending like um, mediums and stuff to like try to help, but I think uh, Circle's infantry, they the OPs that they're spawning from are just so slick that. They could either get yeah, in that's... and annoy the tanks, you know what I'm saying? So then it forces them to move. Yeah. And then if the other tank comes and like shoots them, they're like, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, you tank, you can't take the enemy's spawn point there. You have to face the unlimited spawn wave. Right. Yeah. Is uh, Circle have anything set up for uh, Russo? Uh, no. Nothing right now. You can see uh, Emblem. He is like the closest to Russo, but. I think they're pretty content with capping this as 14 minutes just about circle does cap cemetery here the cemetery has got to take yeah the strip one tiger uh oh 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 what? is he gonna make it oh no but Ronan no. kills him the rocket the rocket It's very good work. I mean, they got one tiger with the 76. That's that's good, but in the grand scheme of things, you'd probably rather have that tank up if you really wanted a chance to retake this. That 76, I mean, I mean, like Circle will take tank trades all day at this point. If you want to, if you want to kill one tiger and let us kill one of your 76s, Circle's gonna be really happy with that exchange. But but Alpha can't be like they have to. They have to get tigers down without losing their heavies, or they're, you know, they're just they're not going to be able to claw their way back in. Yeah. Would you guys? It's say easier. That? It's okay. easier than said than. It's easier said than done. Sorry, just to say, it's easier said than done. It's not like it's easy to kill tanks without losing tanks, but I mean that's what you got to be thinking right now. Yeah. Would you guys say that, um, you know, out of, you know, especially Alpha being like a, a very in a desperate mood they have to be careful with like what what they do with these like last 12 minutes especially here in uh yeah. an airhead plane there's airhead coming to the final point yeah See that we do have 176 right there i do want to just take a look if anybody has seen what's going on over here 
Oh, what? Uh, There's an airhead in the bottom right corner. That's... That's right here. We have a okay. defensive bombing run from... From Circle. Oh my god, look at... Circle's yeah. munitions. Holy shit. Are they sh shooting artillery? They have to be. Yes, yeah, so but maybe the commander, because commander, the commander didn't use his skills. Oh, not too much. Off, often, yeah, not too much. Quite much. Okay. Airhead has been taken. Taken care of. Oh my god. Is that a medium shooting? You see him, right? Where, like, Mayo... So they have... Th there's supposed to be another 76 right here, too. Let's see. Oh yeah, this is a medium. That, that pen. It's interesting. Now... Look at... Can we... Sorry, this is not related to the... Could, can you zoom in on like the main intersection center of the map real quick? Right here? Uh, on the map. Look at all those fucking mines. <laughs> <laughs> that is an impressive number of mines. My god. Sorry. We don't gotta spend a lot of time on that, but holy shit. They've got uh all the tigers moving up now. Uh you can see Alice Alice Tiger is Trying to figure out who the fuck shot him from the south. Uh, it's probably Mark already. But that medium's just getting rocketed from the front, bro. <laughs> it's not having Off, a good uh, day. With a little bit of cap progress here on uh, Cemetery. Yeah. Yeah. Alpha it's still big. has their 76 on the east side there, just on this hedge. If you're Alpha, but you gotta send somebody. I don't know if they have anybody. Gotta send somebody up north and try to get on hospice quick. It's like you're almost your only chance at this point. Because even if they cap cemetery here, they're not gonna be able to set up for a conventional take on hospice uh, after that. There's just not enough time. So you gotta be thinking ahead and and try to get somebody up there so you can get immediate pressure on hospice. It's your only chance to take two points here. Oh, Alpha's already. Come on, please. Yell at your guys to shoot flares so you could kill. <laughs> That's it. He's probably in command chat. I need flares now. Please. Imagine LSC with, green. with uh, nine yeah. minutes left, they send a heavy tank. Try to cap cemetery. Have enough manpower to send an airhead. Like, I don't know. Somewhere uh, like behind here or something. Because there's no OPs over there at all. But that's just, you know. That's just me uh, wanting uh, a very intense game. Exciting game. Well, but it's been good like, so far. Uh, yeah, it's good. Like everybody's meet grid here. Looks like TC. The circle is is shift Wing. <laughs> yeah, they're. <laughs> yeah. They're not giving any breathing room for for Alpha to even like set up uh, a smoke push or anything like that. <laughs> Holy. Six. The medium kills the tiger from the south. Who the fuck are you? All right, you guys are legendary. Good work. Stewart coming in. Um, the circle. They they're just playing it pretty standard. They're trying to push everything out. Once they, I think they box them out of this uh, cornfield then um, it's going to be really, really hard for 
uh, alpha to even like push in this corner. I mean, the hard cap's just right here, so if Alpha can maintain this, but then not get wrapped from these guys, which is kind of happening. Okay. Are they switching tanks? Oh, this is probably a two man. Oh, one man. But yeah, Circle, Circle has been, uh, doing pretty good here guys they yeah since that cap progress they've really locked it down yeah starting to push out i mean cemetery is kind of a tough point from the allies side if you gotta take it you just gotta like run up and down hedgerows for the most part and um obviously that benefits the defenders who can just kind of sit there and wait for you to run into their view American supplies dropping down. Last six minutes. Let's see what Alpha can do. Yeah, you can see the uh, two other tigers. They're playing basically checkpoint like this time. Getting a little bit of progress coming on cemetery, but I don't know how serious of a threat this is. So many OPs bunched up together. This could be bad if. That steward just comes over here. <laughs> like you see, the, the cemetery, it's uh, it's just only one corner. It's like in the middle of your screen. Yeah. If, the, if the artillery just lock that position, that it's just a free buffet. Yeah. If if they try to like run right here, you're just gonna get shot yeah. by like a rifleman. Yeah, That's... yeah. If you're going to be on the open field, so be it. You got shot. But if you want to push through the through this wall, you get artillery. Oh my God! I want to say that that might have that probably was Alpha's artillery that was killing his old guy. <laughs> Oh shit! No, you this is this is this is Alpha's artillery landing right in the middle of cemetery yeah. right now. You can see circles. Circles artillery was like landing over there earlier. See now it's like yeah. switch. So both artillery hitting the just about the same area right now. Stewart goes down by Alice. Bombing run for. Alpha, yeah. like alpha. Yeah, for the five final. seconds to start capping. Doesn't look like it's gonna happen. And That's the, they don't have any tanks, Alpha. For alpha. I see the tank squad leader is going infantry right now. Yeah, and it's getting to the time of the game where you might not have time to even get it to the front line, even if you have the fuel. Yeah. Last three minutes. Yeah, I mean, that's the game at this point, right? You need four minutes to cap two points, so no matter what, Circles are going to win this. I, I don't think it was... I Honestly, I think if these points were in a line, I think it probably ends 3-2. Right. Right. Yeah. yeah. I, I think I think the reason we saw the four one and 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 not to discount, you know, Circle who played very well, but they really played well against the offset points. Like they really had a good, you know, strategy for attacking Cemetery while maintaining Hospice, and they executed it well. And they they almost capped maybe two or three times before they finally did cap. But I think if it was you know, hospice into artillery battery. I just don't know if either team would have been able to, you know, be strong enough to push straight through and cap that way. So, right. um, you know, no, no, no discredit to Circle who, who won and, and deserved to win. Uh, but for Alpha, I think, I mean, it was a close game for most of the way. And you know, you sometimes you get a little bit. Uh, of disadvantage because of the point layout, but that's the way it goes. Like it could have been the other way too, and might have been a different outcome. But I think, 
you know, Alpha's, uh, you know, should should be happy with the way they they played a lot. They did a lot of good things, but ultimately uh, they're going to take the loss. I definitely think that, um, you know, maybe the, the opener was... Uh, it wasn't as strong for for Alpha as um, I mean both teams they didn't get sniped or anything but um, the aggression uh, of of the circle definitely played a part. Uh, you could see the like, Commander Joe. Um, I mean he's done this before. Uh, last year I casted uh, the circle versus uh, 82 AD, um, and 82 AD was highly favored in in that game, and it. But they ended up winning 3-2 because uh, they played aggressive. I mean, um, Alpha, a very good team. Um, you know, the Circle, a very good team. So it's it's nice to see uh, the two two teams play. Uh, yeah, but, it's a very good. But Alpha it's will a very good. take the loss here. And then Circle will pick up their first win so circle will be one and one and um alpha is zero and two um what are your uh last thoughts of this match yamamoto well they both fight well according to me for me yeah mm -hmm. just just like uh, some tank mistakes it w yeah let the alpha lost the cemetery perhaps but uh, yeah, see, the both team are good, and uh, it's a very good it's a very good match to watch. All right, so that will end it as circle as Axis will be Alpha as allies as Hospice. Um, me personally, I don't, I'm not a fan of like the offset points. Um, I mean, maybe because I used to play like artillery, and <laughs> I I hate like <laughs> shifting the the RD, you know, left and right, and it takes so long. But um, yeah, it's uh, it's, it's not too bad. You could see some of the scores. You can see Lord Jacks, they got eight, almost nine hundred each. Let's see for. yeah um i appreciate everybody coming in and watching um wix yamamoto i appreciate you guys uh waking up early well wix waking up early yamamoto for um giving your thoughts on the game and you know your your insights thanks for your invitation cd yeah man yeah thanks thanks yeah. cd it was fun um, yeah it was fun it was uh, fun to watch. I will say, y Yamamoto was saying he's like my my English is not too good. Uh, his English was perfectly fine to me. Um, <laughs> Thank this match. you. So, um, but yeah, uh, thank you guys for coming out. I don't know which one is my actual ending scene. Is it this one? Uh, it's this one. There you go. Uh, but but thank you guys uh, again. Thank you, uh, seasonal uh, alpha and circle GGs, and I'll catch you guys next time.